we have different uh, tables right in which even the these things are different so let's make it another way maybe nicely so you will understand it really good so i have this first name is uh, maybe the product name p name second column is product id and uh, and third column will be maybe the sales and fourth column will be the quantity so this is this is what this comes in my first table okay in my second table maybe i have order id and uh, order order name or maybe the customer name order id should be like or maybe order name yeah it will go order name or maybe the customer id or let's say or maybe the product id product id pid okay or maybe the sales and uh, did they got, got any discount on that uh, purchase on their purchase or not so i have this uh, options okay so so these are my columns what these are my you know table so what do you know how can i join this two tables together so we need to have something common in between them right so we have product id common so always remember we join table when we have one common column in it if you have common common column so using product id i can join this two table correct so now it will look like p name pid sales quantity o id o name sales and discount okay getting it So for join, if you wanted to join these two tables together, we need to have something common in between it. So here in these two tables, uh, which column is common? PID. So using PID, okay. we can join our tables. Correct. So this is like what we are doing. We are joining it row wise. Okay. So um, again. So these are the joins. Okay. Let's let me just uh, give you some glimpses. how join work okay i'm using this thing okay these are the my table okay yes so these are like table number 1 the the first circle this one is table number 1 this one is my table number 2 and whatever common in between na this area is nothing maybe pid if only if we on if we just need this common thing if we just need this common whatever common in between t1 and t2 it is nothing but inner join if you just need common between two tables that is what inner join so in, in inner join is clear na what is inner join yes. that means okay so let's talk about another join now now what is left join left means what this side this side correct so the whole this table the t1 table plus whatever common in between them now this became what my left join okay now let's talk about right join okay so what what do you think what is the right, right join the content of right table which is uncommon and also the content of uh, left join which are common so the common part plus uncommon of right side is nothing but right join okay what about the next join the next join is nothing but let's say this uh, this this is my circle here yeah. or let's say okay one second this so these are the these are two tables t1 and t2 
the whole the uncommon part of t1 plus the uncommon part of t2 plus the uh, inner part inner whatever the common it this is nothing but full outer joint one of both the top table and uncommon from both the table combined together like each and every data together if we combine if we merge now that thing is nothing but what full outer joint so these are my jo tables so i'm just uh, creating a random one somewhere here okay so uh, this is my table number 1 and this is my table number 2 whatever common between two tables we will uh, will have that also and whatever uncommon between two tables we'll have that also the whole data is there if we if you if you say full outer join full data data will combine together not just the common part but not just the left part not just the right part the whole data like if we if we if i apply full outer join here on this ta two table the whole data the whole data p name p id sales quantity oid o name sales and discount will combine together say i have a 1 2 and 3 here and i have a 1 2 and 3 here and let's say i have uh, maybe so okay i have 1 2 3 here and 1 2 3 here if i say inner join so uh, only or uh, let's say i have another uh, row is nothing but the fourth row okay like this okay the product number 4 is there also so i have four rows in this table and three rows in this table if i say inner join so i'll get only data of those uh, those rows which are common so which is nothing but 1 2 and 3 getting it clear say i i need to apply right, left join on it if i apply left join so i'll get only data of left table the whole and sole data of left table plus the common between both the tables so which are the common it's nothing but 1 2 3 and uh, whatever uncommon in left table that will also happen that will also uh, will get it as as in uh, in output okay if i say right outer join or maybe if i say just right to join so right join means what whatever common in between these two tables so i'll get data of pnm sales and quantity and 1 2 3 product as well as i'll get the data of fourth column fourth row as well because which is extra which is uncommon in what right side of my table so i'll get the data and full outer means each and everything i'll get in my records okay so it's quite confusing correct the full outer join if you don't know the data if you are a tableau developer so why we need to you know break your head learning join but it is necessary to learn it for our use only but let's say if i am taking our super store sales data on. okay so these are my super store sales data which have we have been working since now the very first uh, lecture we have been working on same data only okay so if i wanted to put uh, maybe a join so here this is order okay so so what is the speciality of tableau people they want each and everything whatever we wanted to learn like whatever we wanted to do they will like just don't break your head uh, break your head head learning the joins just you know to join these two table so how can i join so i'll just wanted to you know uh, drag it here something like this so if, can you see this doodle it automatically get picked right now what we are doing we are joining it now it joined if you click on it basically it's it doesn't join the thing we are doing here is not connecting or not uh, merging together it this thing is called as what we are creating relation between two table so what is the relationship between this two table so if you you know hover on this uh, line this dotted line then you will see the relationship happen between orders and people uh, many to many relationship and the uh, the common field between those uh, these two tables are nothing but region so region. region column is you know common because of region uh, this relationship happened okay so we haven't use any join we haven't even break our head it's just like you need to just pick it up and drag here if it is uncommon if there is uh, like uncommon between like suppose this way so i think if return and in people if it's common then uh, the relation is not happening between these two tables between what people and return if you hover on it so it's like there is no matching field so that's why we cannot able to you know connect your people and returns together so now what we are doing we are not doing joins here 
we are not using you know did you did i ever you know use something did i ever tell tablu join this two, two table using left join or join this two table using right join or maybe pull out the join no it's like whatever happening is like relationship what relationship is happening now it's like uh, i don't want to do so just i picked it up from here and just join using uh, uh, to orders because they have some com something common which order id is common between orders and returns and uh region is common between region. orders and people so now the whole and whole sheets are you know connected with each other it's not like i mean uh, what i mean to say the whole sheets are connecting with each other it's not we are we haven't merged it okay it's like if you see we have three tables together orders people and returns all are separate it's not combined table we haven't have combined table because we haven't used the joins why because in like uh, in like uh, if you learn tableau like if you uh, you can if you see many videos or whatever maybe the dashboard uh, previously like uh, three or four years before dashboard you will see we need to you know tell the tableau in which uh, which join we need to perform on which tables but here now what happened in updated version of tableau they have created this relationship the new thing is coming up relationship so what is a relationship relationship is just another word of join but in relationship we don't need to specify which type of join the tableau will decide so we are not going to specify the tableau itself is going to specify which join which which join we are going to use on it or the relationship on join when i have created relationship then you will see only the single single tables it's connected but when if i use join on it then the whole table get connected what uh, do like do you understand what i mean to say look like what the layers so what layers are happening here so we are on you know first layer, layer. okay we are on what first layer it's a uh, it's also called as logical layer so this is nothing but what logical layer so currently we are able to see is nothing but logical layer so in which what relationship are happening that doesn't mean joins are not working the tableau is deciding the joins we are not deciding it tableau is deciding but what underneath this logical layer so what is there underneath the logic logical layer we have layer we have this uh, physical layer physical layer and there joins are happening getting it click on it maybe in any on uh, any of this now you entered into logic uh, physical layer if you double click on here now you entered what in uh, this uh, logical layer okay. sorry physical layer i mean to say physical layer but uh, they haven't shown any uh, this thing if you look here look this is now what physical layer and i am manually doing it now you see your join thing is okay. happening so you are merging two together two table together the default join is nothing but inner join if i wanted to okay. mention another join i need to click on it and i need to mention left right or full outer so for that purpose you need to go to you know physical uh, layer so how can you go on physical layer you have to click on any uh this thing you have to click on any table you have to set just double click on it you will go uh, underneath uh, the physical layer okay okay i hope this is clear right how to join the table so we barely use this physical layer because relationship uh, the the outer layer works completely fine for us so what do you need to do now join happen so we have this um, freedom to work on this three table together so we can create dashboard together so what else the questions uh, like maybe the question number one will be like uh, okay found the question using this uh, three tables together just get the question anything do you think maybe which manager is getting maximum revenue okay we haven't used this people the managers are in uh, this people sheet so we can you know con uh, connect this uh, manager from people sheet with the order sheet sales from order sheet correct so maybe which manager is giving me more sales or more revenue which manager is you know generated more which manager is generated maybe more man uh, generated maybe uh, 
more revenue okay so how can you find out the answers you have to go to sheet number 1 so we form the relationship between like the three sheets are together now i need to click on sheet number 1 okay now you can see so i have a table look here the orders fields are here the people fields are here and the return fields are here so i have you know options to select whichever table we have to use now the question is which manager generated more revenue so manager is in uh, this uh, people sheet So I have this person is nothing but manager. So I have to choose this uh, manager. Double click on it. So I'm choosing for managers and which manager is generated more revenue. So I have to uh, yeah profit or you can say more revenue will be profit. Yeah. So you have to click profit. So now this is happen like I I can able to choose different sheets uh, column and I connect it with another sheet and a lot of things are going on and a lot of things are getting. Answered now, okay. So I can see Alex is uh, giving me more. Uh, from Alex, we are generating more revenue. Okay. Now, if I were to decide, like, to increment an uh, any manager's salary, or you know, to promote them into some other higher position. Now, this is like beneficial for me to, uh, you know, analyze the data and maybe I can see Alex is doing great. Now I can promote Alex and increment his salary. Getting. Thank you.